What's up, ladies and gents? I'm your host, Sinistrina1, and welcome back to more of The Evil Within. We are in Chapter 4 now, and we're going to continue on. First of all, I just want to say how I, I think how funny it is that people are telling me, Come on, Strain, you're the stealth master. Turn your flashlight off. Well, let me explain something to you. First of all, the flashlight does not get you caught. <laughs> and uh, second of all, I keep the flashlight on mainly because I want to make sure you guys can see the screen, because the screen is really, really dark sometimes at night. And it's almost impossible for even me to be able to see. And I can't imagine how bad it is for you guys in YouTube land to see. So, uh, whoa, what the hell just happened there? <laughs> that was, uh, that was weird. Um, so I keep, obviously, uh, I keep the flashlight on to make sure that you guys can see everything that is going on in the game. That's, I guess you could say the main reason that I keep that on. So I just wanted to let you guys know that. All right, so we're going to make sure we're full of health. And we have a few other things to do. Let's craft a few. We're uh, good on that, but we could definitely use some. Just four. It looks like we're pretty good with, with most things here. All right, I think that's I think that's good. And remember, this is a let's play, so I don't know what I'm doing. So obviously, um, when we do the walkthrough and go over everything else, it's going to be so much uh, smoother than what you may see it as to be here. So keep that in mind too. It's just weapon parts, man. We went around and searched everywhere and done pretty much everything you could think of, but yet still. We're not even anywhere near close to having, you know, amazing, amazing weapons yet. But it is still pretty early. Alright, so we're heading to a new location now. Let's go ahead and make sure that we're fully stocked up. And set our waypoints. So maybe we still have to report back to O'Neill. Did you find them? Yeah. They're dead. But after what I saw, you're better off without them around. They were planning on killing everybody in here. And now for one emergency, huh? Can't say it's the worst idea I've heard. You're a real piece of work, O'Neill. You know that? I'm just being a realist. You can't save everybody. It's impossible. Mobius made emergency plans for a reason. If they never made this twisted machine, they wouldn't need emergency plans in the first place. Maybe so. But look at what they've done. It's pretty incredible. Still a company man after all this, huh? Hope your loyalty pays off for you in the end. Because right now, it seems like they don't give a shit about you. What do you mean? They sent you in here, didn't they? Sorry, I didn't mean to make you angry. Here. I made some more of these for you. For your troubles. Nice, and we get two. <laughs> All right, well, we got this, so now let's might as well go back here. And... Since we have something else that we can get. Uh, let's see. Reload time. We got 90 parts left. Yeah, sure, I think this will be good. Alright. We're good to go, so now let's do it. Looks like we're heading back to where we were before. I 
I'm sure it ain't gonna be easy. You know the deal, let's go ahead and upgrade a little bit. We've got some keys. Oh, is that different? Huh. Was that door there before? What the hell is this? It's a chance to test your skills. Step right up and try your luck, detective. This is insane. You'd be insane to pass this up. Steady your hand and put your shooting skills to work. No need to worry about ammunition in here. Okay. And the aiming isn't as easy as you guys might think, actually. That's pretty cool, though. I mean, what are they doing with the evil uh, with the evil within? This is so weird. I don't know why it says easy. We did wow, so we actually picked up uh, fifty and fifteen hundred green gel. That's that's actually. I mean, it's pretty cool that you get to do this. Um, I will give it that. It just. I don't know. I, I'm so weirded out by the directions that they're taking. Whoa. The, the directions that they're actually taking this, you know? I see you're in need of my services again. Always. All right, so we got should have at least two keys now. Oh. Back again, I see. And in need of some improvements. You're getting closer to what you seek. I feel it. My daughter. She's somewhere inside this place. Yes, and you're determined. I can sense a change in you. Let's change you further. Give you the tools you need to find her. All right, so we've got some more upgrades here. 12,000 points. I'm definitely getting this one now. After seeing what happened last time. Melee attacks are just... I don't know. This is something that might be come in handy if you think about it. Bottles in your inventory will automatically be used to break free if an enemy grabs you, but it doesn't work against certain types of enemies. And, well, we don't have enough for that one, but... What is defiance? Oh, wow. Oh, that's actually... that's unique.
All right. So I'm very interested and uh, curious to see what everyone's thoughts on this is going to be. We did get 60. Which probably still isn't going to really give us enough. We're pretty much maxed out on a lot of things. I think that's going to be good enough. You might hear my dog barking in the background. <laughs> now we don't have enough for anything. So uh, what's really cool is uh, Bethesda's been sending me a lot of um, goodies for the Evil Within. Uh, I'm going to go ahead and just go ahead and save right here. They've been sending me a lot of things uh, that has to do with the Evil Within. And it's been really, really cool and fun. Um, they sent me like a cat, a broken mirror that resembles this mirror. Uh, they've sent me a, a Polaroid and different things. And it's, it's, I've been having a blast getting these uh, packages in the mail. Really fun stuff. And they're still sending stuff. <laughs> eeriness that surrounds me, you know? And we haven't fully explored this area either. I mean, like... Don't get me wrong, we've explored, you know, a lot. And we did all the side stuff, but... Just a bottle. I wonder where all the enemies are. There's one. It's coming. It's coming. Walls won't stop it. Doors won't stop it. Nothing will. Can't hide from it. That doesn't sound like any of the other ones. Don't you like how it stops doing what it was doing the moment we get close? And now there's a bunch of enemies. I don't know how they would even expect you to stealth five enemies that are this close to each other. The only thing I can think of is that I have to go around. You hear that?
like there's something waiting in that bush over there. More of them up there. Again, flashlight does not give you away. I just hate how people are so obtuse to that. They don't they don't see it. It really did sound like there was something inside that bush there. Let's go take a look at the signal source. It's, it's still pretty close to where we're going, so... I don't think we've ever been in here. I don't think we can. Okay. Oh, we, whoa, we, we definitely passed it. Holy crap. I didn't realize that it was that actually. anything. Okay. Oh my god, you gotta be kidding me. See, I knew it. Oh jeez. They do, they just pop up out of nowhere, too. So where was he hiding? He just come out of nowhere because there's nothing up there. Yeah, this is exactly where we were, right in front of those bushes. I find that hilarious that we were already right here.
Oh, you gotta be kidding me. I hate when it does that. I don't think they can enter. Well, maybe they can. Again, none of this is going to happen when I do the walkthrough, but we should have been able to stealth that character. It was like at the last... I don't know what it was. Just, it's just so slow. But they always do the same thing. They always look left, they always look right a few times. Ooh, pouch upgrade. Well, I guess I'm really, really glad I uh, found and located that. Be ready. What's happening? It's freezing. Oh my god! What the fuck is happening? And this is not even something you have to do!
gotta be some way to get out of here. a picture of my family this might get me out of here I just imagine that? No. That was... What was that thing? Was that real or all in my mind? Oh, we got another slide. That's right, there's these slides. Forgot about that. Alright, let's get back to the signal now. So when it comes to, let's see... I don't know how much damage that uh, this enemy would take, but it's not a risk. Probably should let Kidman know what's going on. Kidman, can you hear me? Loud and clear. What have you got for me? The good news is that I located O'Neill, and he was able to get me on the trail to find Lily. That's great. The bad news is that Union is literally falling apart around me, and it's mostly populated by corpses and monsters. Oh, and that psycho I told you about? The one with the powers he shouldn't have? He's got Lily. I'm getting ready to head into the Marrow, which you neglected to tell me about, to get to him. Sorry we didn't have time for our briefing before sending you in, but we didn't think it would be this bad. It's just as bad as Beacon in here. No, it's worse. My daughter wasn't stuck in Beacon. Okay, calm down. Maybe I can help you out. Can you give me any information on this person? Male, about five foot ten, black hair. He fancies himself as some sort of artist. That's not much to go on. Tell me something I don't know. I'm on my way to City Hall. I'll call you later. We'll refill just a little bit of health that we have. <sighs> yeah, 
And we did get a new slide. Let's go check it out too. Again, I'm just trying to show you everything in this. We most likely won't do everything in the actual walkthrough. So we missed the second one, wherever that one was. You still up, Kidman? No rest for the wicked. What's going on? I can't believe Lily is still alive. The fire. Lily wasn't killed in the fire. You know this now. Tell that to my brain. Tell that to the nightmares I've been having for years. Why did they take her? Out of all the little girls in the world, why mine? Mobius took Lily long before I joined them. I know you don't believe in coincidences, but maybe you see a pattern because you want to. You know that some crimes just... happen. There's no real reason for it. Just the wrong person, at the wrong place, at the wrong time. No. I refuse to believe that. Regardless, the fire is a memory that you need to purge, Sebastian. It wasn't your fault that it happened. And you didn't lose Lily because of it. Try to remember that. Well, this one's definitely diving a lot more into that backstory, so. Thanks, Kitty. Oh, that's cool. I still don't think it's enough for us to really dive deep into the upgrades. I just wanted to see that. Alright, here we go, finally. <laughs> Twenty some minutes into the chapter. So this is the computer O'Neill was talking about. Let's try that password. Of course, we've already seen this once. I did say we were going to need that gas mask. My question is, why is there any enemies in this section? You know what I mean? Like, there shouldn't be any enemies at all. If this is the one- if this is the section that they own. Mobius. Seems like things didn't go so well down here, either. Isn't that what we just did? I don't know, I'm gonna go back and see if that's actually something you have to do. No, it's a different guy. Okay. Could this be the whole map of Union? It used to be so huge. Looks like they were still designing parts of Union in here.
So did we get anything from it, or? I guess that's it. How convenient, a room that you can't go anywhere <laughs> with this little thing here. What do you got for me? Give me something good. Of course not. There we go. I think I'm starting to get a little better at the keyboard controls. I know I'm so late to the game, guys, but it took me years before I really went over to playing mostly PC games. And just recently have I started playing most of the games that I do with a con uh, keyboard and mouse. Okay, well, there's a room, but you can't get in. Let's see. Waiting for just a fight to start happening here. Should be able to step on his head. Exit B2. Looks like there's a road. As long as it still exists. So we're all going to be able to go there. Before we do that, let's go up here. Pouch upgrade, uh, additional crossbows. I mean, I should be able to stomp on it. Because you know it's going to wake up. I feel like as soon as we do... this little thing, then a bunch of enemies are going to come upon us, just because kind of expect it, especially since you see these enemies just lying around and you know they're not completely dead. Emergency lockdown procedures are currently in effect. Lockdown can be disengaged by tuning to the frequency on your communicator. Might as well give it a try.
Hold on. Uh, too high. There you go. Emergency lockdown deactivated. Please wait for system reboot of each annex. Stand by. Recreation area emergency lockdown disengaged. Please wait while system reboots. Research wing emergency lockdown. Oh my god, he's already on me. So they just know exactly where you are. There's no ex explanation, no, no hiding, no nothing. Oh god. I hate that. You can't shoot like two shotgun blasts fast. Oh, and she knows exactly where I am. Well, it says that there's someone here, like, six away, but we can't go into there, wherever it is. Unless it's down here. I'm glad I do a lot of searching around and stuff. I think that pays off a lot. <laughs> 